So right now we've got a brand new exchange in FC Mobile. If you go ahead and get into it, you can see it's not actually loading for me, but there we go. It did load right now. We've got 93 to 94 overall team of the year exchange pack right there, as you can see, where we can pack brand new players. Some of them, for example, for example, uh, there is, for example, Saul Campbell. I did say, for example, a lot of times, but we've got Saul Campbell there. We've got Ultimate Team on the R cards with Frimpong and Allison. We've got two Ederson cards who are actually the same. Those two Ederson cards are actually way same. They've got the same stats and all that, I think, right? Oh, I mean, this card has got a little bit better stats, but they are pretty much the same. But after this one, we're gonna get brand new exchanges. We're gonna go ahead and talk about that. What type of players you can pack from those uh, from those exchanges as well. And then we're gonna talk about new heroes exchanges as well as the new Waller token exchange. The similar one that we are gonna get uh, that, that we used to, uh, that we go with Roberto Carlos, Hulit and Jairzinho. But it's not gonna be the same card that obviously it's gonna be heroes card art and it might be a little bit different. So make sure to like and subscribe if you are excited for it. First of all, I'm not really sure if I'm gonna be able to open these packs. I mean, should I open these packs? I don't really think it's worth it. I don't really think it's worth it to open these packs because most likely I'm gonna get a 93 overall card and he's gonna be worth like 89 million coins. If I get lucky and I get someone that's worth, uh, that's actually worth a lot of coins, I guess that's possible as well. But I never, never get lucky with 93 to 94 overall player packs. So I'm not gonna open any or any of those packs. We got 92 overall free, not not free, but exchange Griezmann card rather as, as well. I didn't actually know that one came out. Um, as well, but yeah, am I am I gonna do this? Probably not either. I don't really need him, and three star recruit 86 pace is not really the best one. But let's go ahead and check out the new exchanges that we're gonna get later on this video or later in this video. I'm gonna go ahead and open some of the packs as well. So during team of the year, we are basically gonna be getting one more of that high overall exchange pack, and that's gonna be 96 to 97 overall, where we will need a 95 overall team of the year card. Uh, after that one, we are still gonna get this type of exchanges, but there is not uh, there is not gonna be team of the year anymore, right? It's gonna be heroes event after that. So we're gonna get some more exchanges during heroes event, but we are gonna get 96 to 97 overall team of the year player pack, where we can pack ultimate team of the year cards, team of the year nominees, and uh, and I continue the art as well. We can back Matheus from that one, Rodri, Messi, Haaland, Salah, Schweinsteiger, Jude, uh, Kylian Mbappe, uh, Kevin De Bruyne, Ruben Diaz, Cristiano, as well as uh, Harry Kane, Bernardo, and Huichaguara Celia. After that one, then during Heroes event, we're gonna get this exchange as well. It's gonna be a Waller exchange, which is gonna be quite exciting indeed. There is gonna be a daily bonus exchange, just like we've got with Team of the Yard. It's gonna be 90 to 95 overall and tradable uh, base icons or heroes. Not the best one. I don't think that's gonna be the best exchange you can open just because there are still base icons and heroes. And base cards aren't really gonna be that great anymore. We've got, we're gonna have 93 to 94 overall heroes slash rivals cards. So right now, for example, when we, uh, uh, we, we've got the same we've got similar exchange right we've got similar exchange with 93 to 94 overall cards but that uh, that time we will be able to pack hero cards as well there's gonna be 93 to 97 overall and tradable heroes pack which is gonna be cool 95 overall heroes slash rivals card it's a similar one that we've got right now as well we can only pack team of the year cards but right now we can pack or uh, when when heroes event comes out we can actually pack heroes and rivals so no team of the year there which is interesting i think they're gonna add team of the year as well maybe maybe they're gonna add team of, team of the year as well but we're gonna have 96 to 97 overall with a hero slash team of the year as well during the heroes event though there is gonna be a main chapter which is gonna be chapter one where we will have uh, some milestones we will have to complete uh, milestone one which is the motor and tricky beast uh, we will have to complete milestone two, which is the conductor in milestone three with flash freeze and uh, the Arctic soldier right there. And these ones, uh, some of them are some of the later challenge, uh, some of the later chapters as well. So for example, here we've got chapter two, uh, which is Heroes March, and you can go ahead and check what that one is. Uh, there are gonna be four, four milestones. There are gonna be five teams, maybe five weeks because of that as well. And these are gonna be um, chapter four, chapter five, chapter six, chapter seven, and chapter eight. These are gonna be some of the ones that we can go ahead and complete. We don't actually know the requirements for some of these cards, what it is gonna be based on, but we do know that chapter four is gonna be based on Brazilian players at least. I think Saprit has confirmed that uh, the chapter four is gonna be based on Brazilian players. That's all I know about this one. Here is the card that I've seen for Waller 
Waller, for example, rather, as you can see, 94 overall Waller, it looks very, very nice. I just feel like they're not, uh, they're not gonna be this color, right? I feel like it's gonna be a blue car a color because I think that's uh, that that's what has been said about this new uh, new heroes cards. But I do like this card art a lot. I do like this card art, and this is made by this guy right there. I don't know how to pronounce his name exactly, but I'm gonna say Fan Min How. I'm sorry, but you probably know him as well. He's a YouTuber. He does a lot of uh, he does he tweets a lot on Twitter as well. Uh, so make sure you go on and follow him and subscribe to him on his channel and all that. Let's now go ahead and open some exchange packs. Then, um, as as we saw, we do have new Grimaldo and Griezmann. I'm not gonna do either of them. I mean, let's see what Grimaldo needs. Um, it's not it's not awful. It's not great either though. I, I don't think I'm gonna do it. I don't need a 90 overall left back either way. Anyways, let's go ahead and do this exchange first. 80 to 97 overall. I don't even have a single silver card. Wow, I'm gonna use an 80 overall. I don't really mind it too much, but I don't have a single 70 overall. 70 plus overall. That's interesting. We got 84 overall, overall Ashley Young, 79, and then 82 overall Nunes as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and open that one, right? I'm gonna open this pack. Um, I don't have enough 84s, but I can use 85. 80 to 97 overall player packs, definitely my favorite ones. I could have done this exchange right there. Base player exchange, 70 to 79, and used one of the cards in that one. But doesn't doesn't really matter that much now. Does not really matter that much. We do have 93 to 94. Am I going to do it? No, I'm not going to do it. All right, I'm not going to do it uh, because I don't think I'm going to be making coins from that exchange. I'm just going to do this one because I think I've got a chance to make coins from this exchange. I need to sell so many of these on the Arno Mini cards, by the way. I always forget to sell those cards. And yeah, I should have sold them a long time ago, to be fair, but it's all right. We did not get a team of, uh, team of the year workout. It's going to be Belgium. Okay, that's... Oh, I thought that was going to be Kevin De Bruyne, but it's, it's only Yuri Tillemans right there. Give me someone higher overall, at least. Wow, it's not. 85 overall is actually the highest overall. Kimmy just has got a team of the year nominee card or honorable mentions card. Why did you not give me that version then? Why the hell did you not give me that version? Yeah, that, that pack is trash. That pack is very, very bad right there. That pack is very, very bad. We're going to put um, Taremi again. And we're going to fill it up again with 85 overall cards. Let's go. Give me... Just just give me someone like uh, Messi, someone like Haaland, someone 90, 93 plus. 93 plus is what I want, okay? 93 plus is what I want. Team of the year, it's an icon or a hero. It's not a... Oh, no, that's... That is either Sanchez or Hernandez. It is Sanchez. Is Hernandez even in the game anymore? I'm not 100% sure. I think he is, right? But we got Hugo Sanchez, right? The, the Real Madrid legend. And... I mean, this is a better pack, definitely a better, uh, better pack, but it's not a great one either way. It's not a great one. Probably made profit though from this pack, right? Is it fair to say I, I made profit from that one? I'm not sure. Anyways, I'm going to open one more. I am putting in 86 of roster instead of 84s. But it's okay. We're gonna open one last 82 to 97 of raw player pack and we'll see what we can pack. Still no team on the air vocal. That's bad. We got that's in Belmo. That's not even Onana. That's 80. No, that is, that is a 90 overall card to be fair, but it's not it's not great again, is it? I mean 90 overall card is worth 5 million coins now, so that's I guess decent. Other than that, not really happy that much with that one. But we can open this standard pack as well. So we're gonna go ahead and open that and then the video right there. No workout. So that's it.